Hey guys, what's up? Hadn't uh, been on here in a little while. We're uh, side dressing cotton. For you that, those of you that don't know, it's a uh, pretty liquid nitrogen. That's what's in that tank back there. There's a wheel and a chain and it, a pump and it pumps uh, liquid nitrogen through those red hoses. There's little things right there. And the gauges, they float a ball. Kind of wish there was some type of alarm similar to a planter monitor, but uh, it's one reason I like running auto steer uh, on that so I can keep a pretty close watch because it doesn't take much to, uh, to stop them up, but little faster now. Probably six, six, six and a half, a little less. And uh, pump should be able to keep up, keep up. Putting out like 28 gallons of acre. Uh, so I'm going to get over like 28 acres uh, with a 700, 750 gallon tank, I believe. You fill it all the way up. You usually don't get all that out of it. Don't want to spill much of that. It's pretty expensive, but turn around right here, pick up one and three, swing out a little. And what that'll do, the three, I've got the three, <clears throat> number three hydraulic. Uh, I'll back that turn earlier right there. Just to go on down. But number three hydraulic picks up those uh, outside wings or outside section on the wings which is really handy because uh sometimes that that toolbar gets to rock it a little bit as you can see um you know that that little knife and coulter get in the ground right there should have turned the coverage off we got it on manual coverage because we're not running any hydraulics or a three-point hitch i'm sure there's a way to do it if anybody knows and these i'm not as familiar with these new uh Four, 46 40s or whatever those um, screens right here are these displays of deers they're awesome I love them but uh, I'm not quite as well versed as much experience as I do with those old 26 30s I know my, know my way around them pretty good but getting on 12 rows setting it down a little off right there for some reason center up Here. So yeah, this will, we put this on corn a lot too. Um, my dad's actually got the spreader truck. He should be down here in a minute. I know he done all the field over there with a dry granule. Nitrogen urea or whatever you call it. Whatever you call it. Different insol, I think is what they're calling the liquid nowadays. It's just fertilizer. Nitrogen fertilizer. Um, I'm sure there's a difference. I don't, I don't know exactly the chemical differences in all of them, but anyway, what I'm putting out is liquid. He's putting out some granule blend, and uh, Sam had moved on to Bruce. I sprayed earlier this morning. Uh, sprayed a little cotton, uh, put some bidrin and uh, Virginia Roundup on probably 250 acres of cotton with the 4030 down in Calhoun County. It's later planted. This right here, as you can see, it's it's doing pretty well. Uh, it might be, well, it's the very first, but it's some of the first. Some of the first that we planted. We got rained out like two weeks. It was cold early May, like 46 degrees on like the 5th of May below. So we held off for a little while. And we started planting like the 10th of May, whenever that video was posted, basically. Uh, our last, I think that was our last video. So, yeah, I'm gonna try to start making more videos if uh, I'll give a little more detail on this. If anybody has any opinions on uh, what they would want the next video to be about, uh, like I said, I apologize for not being able to uh, kind of have my hands full lately and having to 
do a lot uh, with planting time. I hadn't, hadn't really had a free hand. I'd change, but I would dip, I would plant, I would spray, I would plant beans. Uh, I didn't get any videos of us planting beans, but if we do, there's, there's pretty soon we're gonna plant this field right in front of me on top of this hill. And uh, I'll try to get some footage of that. Show y'all the bean planters rolling. But, yeah, y'all let me know in the comments and try to get things going a little, a little more consistently. Okay. Fold these wings up. Back up right here. And drag it over these gullies. Anyway, yeah, you are just gonna be here in a minute. I'm almost out. If you can see that liquid dropping around in the bottom there. Yeah, he should be here by now. I know we feel him, man. Alright, thank y'all for watching. Stay tuned. You ever did make it? This right here is what turns it. Kind of loose. This is still working. Tighten that up a little bit. I'm having an adjuster. Yeah, we can adjust that that way. Snug that up. Uh, if it ain't slipping. I guess it's. It's not bad. Not that bad once it starts. Once it locks in. Of course, that's gonna push that back some, probably. We had one one time that kept coming loose, kept working loose. Might check on that later.